Uh, hey guys, welcome to our channel again. Uh, so we are continuing this night with the uh, reactions. Uh, this is episode 7. Yes, it's 7. Uh, the title is uh, It's the Great Pumpkin Sam Winchester. So previous episode was really really funny and awesome. One of my favorites, definitely. Uh, I like when Dean is crazy and funny and I don't know. It has this kind of behavior, weird. I'm I'm always laughing to him. I do know that Sam sometimes has funny bits. I don't remember when he was drunk and something like that. I mean, but I always uh, I always find Dean funnier than Sam. Uh, so yeah, that's it. Uh, I mean, I, we don't have anything like more to say about the previous mm -hmm. episode. It wasn't uh, anything about the like main plot this season, which is uh, appearance of uh, angels and Dean coming back from the hell. Uh, whenever you watch our reactions, uh, turn on subtitles. We are not speaking in English during the reactions. about this stuff but it actually happens more than you might imagine sure. hex bag this isn't your typical hex bag mm. no gold thread an herb that's been extinct for 200 years and this is celtic and i don't mean some new age knockoff it looks like the real deal like 600 years old real and uh that is the charred metacarpal bone of a newborn baby. Oh, gross. Relax, man. It's like at least 100 years old. She can really hold her breath. <laughs> Jenny? I didn't happen to know a man named Luke Wallace. Agent Seeger, FBI. Um, who's Luke Wallace? He died yesterday. I don't know who that is. Maybe they're working a spell. Check this out. Three blood sacrifices over three days. The last before midnight on the final day of the final harvest. <laughs> Celtic calendar. The final day of the final harvest is October 31st. Halloween. Exactly. Maybe it agenda. What exactly are the uh, blood sacrifices for? Uh, if I'm right, this witch is summoning a demon. And not just any demon. Sam Hain. Am I supposed to be impressed? Dean, Sam Hain is the damn origin of Halloween. The Celts believed that October 31st was the one night of the year when the veil was thinnest between the living and the dead. Oh, yeah. And it was Sam Haynes' night. I mean, masks were put on to hide from him, sweets yeah. left on doorsteps to appease him, faces carved yeah, into pumpkins to worship him. People can only be performed every 600 years. Yeah, and the 600 year marker rolls around tomorrow night. Naturally. But sure is a lot of death and destruction for one demon. That's because he likes company. Once he's raised, Sam Hain can do some raising of his own. Raising what exactly? Dark, evil crap, and lots of it. I mean, they follow him around like a friggin' Pied Piper. So we're talking ghosts? Yeah. Zombies? Mm hmm. Leprechauns? Dean. Those little dudes are scary. Small hands. Look, it just starts with ghosts and ghouls. This sucker keeps on going. By night's end, we are talking every awful thing we've ever seen. Everything we fight. All in one place. It's gonna be a slaughterhouse. So, our apple-bobbing cheerleader? Tracy, the Wallace's babysitter. She told me she'd never even heard of Luke Wallace. Yes, Oh, Interesting look for a centuries-old witch. Yeah, well, if you were a 600-year-old hag and you could pick any costume to come back in, wouldn't you go for a hot cheerleader? Oh, no. Ah! Huh? Bring 
bring back memories. Što je ovo bilo? What do you mean? Sime našeg tamo da se moraju napraviti neke tri žrtve. Dobro, ali što je njega odabra? Što je njega odabra? Uh, if Principal Murrow hadn't walked by when he did, Tracy would have clawed my eyes out. Why? I, you know, I was only trying to rap with her about her work. It, it had gotten inappropriate and disturbing. More disturbing than, than uh, those guys? She would cover page after page with these bizarre cryptic symbols. And then there were the drawings. Detailed images of killings. Gory, primitive. She would depict herself in the middle of them, participating. Symbols? What kind of symbols? Um, anything like this? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that... Sir! Sir! Wait! It's Castiel. The angel. Him I don't know. Hello, Sam. Oh, my God. Er, uh, I didn't mean to... Sorry. It's an honor. Really, I, I've heard a lot about you. And I, you. Sam Winchester, the boy with the demon blood. Glad to hear you've ceased your extracurricular activities. Let's keep it that way. Do you know where the witch is now? We're working on it. That's unfortunate. What do you care? The raising of Sam Hain is one of the 66 seals. So this is about your buddy Lucifer. Lucifer is no friend of ours. What are you going to do? You, uh, both of you, you need to leave this town immediately. Why? Because we're about to destroy it. Lucifer cannot rise. He does, and how rises with him. Is that something that you're willing to risk? We'll stop this witch before she summons anyone. Your seal won't be broken, and no one has to die. We're wasting time with these mud monkeys. Do you think you can stop us? No. But if you're going to smite this whole town, then you're going to have to smite us with it, because we are not leaving. You went to the trouble of busting me out of hell. I figure I'm worth something to the man upstairs. Do you want to waste me? Go ahead. See how he digs that. And we'll drag you out of here myself. Yeah, but you'll have to kill me. Then we're back to the same problem. We'll find that witch, and we will stop the summoning. Castillo? Enough. I suggest you move quickly. And Evan, and this is what I've been praying to? Just because there's a couple of bad apples doesn't mean the whole barrel's rotten. I mean, for all we know, God hates these tricks. Don't give up on this stuff, is all I'm saying. I mean, Babe Ruth was a dick, but the baseball's still a beautiful game. There's a reason we were sent to save him. He has potential. He may succeed here. Yes, Miss Lada, call my you know our true orders. Are you prepared to disobey? Our master's return. The spell works a two-man job, you understand. And on the juice.
is beyond time. Whore. <laughs> Sam, no, you're not using your psychic whatever. But don't even think about it. Ruby's knife is enough. Why? Well, because the angel said so, for one. I thought you said there were a bunch of fanatics. Well, I happen to be right about this one. I don't know, Dean. It doesn't seem like they're right about much. Well, forget the angels, okay? You said yourself, these powers, it's like playing with fire. Please. Uh, Don, you, uh, you locked us in. Help them! Dude, you're not going off alone! Do it! Let me guess. You're here for the I told you so. No. No, I'm good, because I'm really not that interested. Your orders were to follow my orders? It was a test. To see how you would perform under battlefield conditions, you might say. All of me is still here because of my brother and me. You misunderstand me, Dean. Not like you think. I was praying that you would choose to save the town. You were. I don't know what is right and what is wrong anymore. Whether you passed or failed here. But in the coming months, you will have more decisions to make. I don't envy the weight that's on your shoulders, Dean. I truly don't. Uh, so guys, we're done with episode seven. seven. Episode seven. Uh, again, one of my, um, I mean, favorite episodes. I, <laughs> I can't say anymore. I can't say favorite episodes anymore because practically I, I'm, I'm loving, I'm loving almost every single episode in season four and season five, where where uh, Cass is appearing and uh, everything related to the main plot of the show and everything related to an angels and demons. So, I really, really have a lot of episodes that I like, and this episode is uh, very good because we are seeing one more seal being broken. Sam Hain is still released. Uh, we see somehow that Sam is not losing his faith, but he is disappointed because he expected same as we maybe were uh, would expect for angels to be like merciful protectors, guardians of people, and now there he's he's seeing that angels are actually soldiers and that they have some kind of war to lead. Season 4, Dean is having more and more faith. I like I like when people have faith. I mean, uh, no matter... You can have faith in better tomorrow, in, uh, I don't know, in people, in God, generally. I, I love when people have faith because faith in something, I mean, uh, is, is the thing that keeps you uh, moving 
on and on. So I like that Dean is changing in that kind of Dean way. Dean said or change. They like um, yes. uh, different person. Uh, not not just the, yeah different person, but it's it's like they are uh, changing sides. Yeah. Uh, Sam is losing the faith. Dean yes. is getting his faith, but that's everything because of Castiel. When Sam died, Demon. Uh, return him to life so basically every person when dies the, it, it has some kind of influence or uh, some kind of impact on Sam but when Dean died and when Dean returned from hell I mean Sam wasn't in hell Sam was dead uh, but when Dean returned from hell he was returned by by, by an angel yes. and I believe that in the whole process the angel like completely uh, healed him I think that Dean always uh, thought of angel of Castile as his guardian angel you know we all have some mm. kind of guardian angel I think it's because of that so guys um, uh, we have uh, one more maybe episode to watch okay. So uh, we are done with this episode. Uh, subscribe if you like our uh, reactions, and yeah, we see each other with the with the next episode. Bye.